Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June 17th of 2022. Well, it is titled Good Morning Planets from Chile. So what do we see here? Well, here is the recent view in the sky from Chile taken just a couple of days ago on June the 15th. And in this case, we now have all five planets visible to the naked eye visible in the morning sky just before sunrise. So our sun would be off the screen down to the bottom here. And the uh, planets in this case actually happen to be in order of distance from the sun. Now that's just a coincidence. It really has nothing to do with anything as they can be at any position relative to each other from the way we observe them in the solar system. But here we have very low down Mercury and Mercury the hardest of the planets to be able to see because it is so close to the sun and never gets very far away from it. So it's getting right now about as far away as it ever gets and that makes it barely visible if you know where to look right off over the horizon shortly before sunrise. Up above that and to the left and even e much easier to see is the planet Venus. Venus the brightest object in the sky after the sun and the moon. Uh, very easily to see, easy to see in the morning sky right now. And as we go further up, we see the red planet Mars and the largest planet in the solar system, Jupiter, relatively close together there. And then way up to the upper left hand side, we see Saturn, the great ringed planet out in the sky. Now, these are the five planets that were known to ancient astronomers. So these are the five that were originally seen and are the five that can be seen with the naked eye. The next planet to have been discovered would have been actually Earth right? identifying Earth as being a planet would have made it the sixth planet and then Uranus discovered in the 1700s and Neptune in the 1800s then round out the eight planets currently known in our solar system. So right now five of those planets are easily visible in the morning sky right before sunrise. So if you get a chance to see them it's a great chance to see this. Now this is how it looks in Chile and the, it would look a little bit different. In fact it would be tilted in a different direction and at a little bit shallower angle for those in the northern hemisphere. So it won't look quite the same if you're north of the equator as it does here south of the equator because of the different perspective from different locations on our spherical Earth. So that was our picture of the day for June 17th of 2022. It was titled Good Morning Planets from Chile. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.